Okay. This is an air conditioner. But, unfortunately, there is some. ice on the side of the air conditioner and dripping underneath. So the air conditioner got a little too iced over. Ooh, look at the hand. Now. Okay, hold on. Eh. Interesting. Well, it iced over, so we'll go ahead and let it thaw. is 24 hours later. I simply allowed this to sit, not running whatsoever. Uh, this particular unit, for example, has a stipulation. And is it going to focus? Probably not. There we go. Alright, so, at these fun little settings, the exhaust is actually upward instead of outward on this unit. It's actually angled, you know, a little different. But, wait three minutes before restarting. Okay, you can see the fan slowing. Okay, so now that the fan is slowed down. Alright. This thing doesn't really have a drip to it. It actually, yeah, I guess, kicks the moisture out. So when this thing ice is over, all of the moisture just kind of builds. So looking in here, this is how the unit normally looks. So there's this screen which is next to impossible to remove when it ices over because it ices this to this frame so not bad nothing iced over doing just fine but this is how it normally works Putting the frame back in is actually pretty easy. Now, and then this just clips right back up. So, I actually have to wait. I'm not going to wait that long for the video. Perfectly fine. There you go. Now, if you don't do that, and eh, you get to be, it gets to be a little bit of a mess. That much ice thawed in here, unfortunately, couldn't really get it out. So, it ended up thawing in here, ended up having a lot of moisture in, but that's why I tried to let it sit for, say, the 24 hours. If you can't, you can't. And honestly, when you start this thing back up, it just, you know, you can hear it actually blend the water. So, long story short, if it ices over, just be aware of it. Hey, why not?